Momo Market. Here we come. But I think I'm an emerald. <laughs> yup. All right. We will get... Is there a stable here? I think so. Stable, stable. Stable to my right and then left. Excuse me. Excuse me. Sir? Can you hear me? Hello? Howdy, howdy. Hi. Uh, where Do you know where I can find the stables? Oh, yeah, yeah. That building right over here. Over here? Okay. It's like in this, uh, in this pen over here. Okay. All right. Thank you so much. No worries. No worries. What was your name? Uh, Chase. Chase, uh, Eleanor. It's pleasure to meet you, Eleanor. Nice to meet you, too. It's this one over here? Yeah, yeah. Just okay. Follow that down there. All right, thank you. Should be a table in there, in the stable boy. All right, thank you. No worries. All right, we are going to take our rent horse. God. Sorry, excuse hey me. You ain't supposed to be here. I'm just getting a horse. We shouldn't be quarreling anyhow. Oh, okay, sir. Oh shoot. Where'd it go? <laughs> it just disappeared there. Alright. We're running our horse from Emerald so we can go to Let's go to the Momo Market. Over, over. Well, let's go to Blackwater first, actually. Is it really that way? Turn around. Okay, to the left. Okay, we're going left. All right, let's go. Is that circus over there? What is that? Oh yeah, it is a circus, okay. Market chipmunk has entered the fray. Oh shoot! <laughs> Reading chat got me distracted. <laughs> Just ran into a bush or trees. Hello, Sarah. This stick and go to all rusty for a spin. Ooh, this is playing all in order. Nice, nice. Yeah, it was a complete surprise. I was not expecting to make the market today, but here we are. Of course it's raining. Alright, hold on. <laughs> Our bags are so empty. <laughs> Get ready to go to brunch. Nice! I love breakfast, brunch, any of that. It's my favorite kind of food. American, that is. I love eggs, bacon, bagels, lox, cream cheese, waffles. <laughs> Just, should I keep going? <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, brunch is the best. This way is... Yes, yes, this is the way I want to go. Yes, yes. 
Yes? Y yes. Y uh, oh, here we go. No market for me today. Oh, that's all right. You have a good brunch. Oh, wait, wait, this way. I think I get the picture. <laughs> oh, for me, listing breakfast items. <laughs> I'll, I'll have breakfast for dinner any day. Any day. Oh, okay, question. Um, <laughs> if you're still here, uh, for Sarah. Or anybody who's interacted with Eleanor, but I don't know who's in chat, but um, I feel like I'm not consistent with her voice. Like, sometimes I, I got, I think, oh, am I not high enough? And then I like, I pitch it higher and then I'm like, wait, is that too high? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, man. This is why my next character, which will likely be a long character, maybe, possibly, quite possibly, maybe, uh, will just be my regular voice because <laughs> I, I can't multitask. <laughs> Yes, sorry, I'm a mobile, mobile and managing a toddler. Oh, you're totally fine. You're totally fine. I just might not understand some of your posts because I might have, my brain might have moved on, but I, I understood it. I don't notice the differences. I'm bad to ask. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, at least it's not that, that obvious, like in your face, obvious. <clears throat> I've definitely, I've definitely caught myself being a little too low. That's usually when she is comforting someone, I think. I do notice she's a lot more direct and her tone is flatter than Elsie's. <laughs> yeah, I would, yeah, that's pretty accurate. <laughs> that's pretty accurate. <laughs> I do try to be a lot more direct on her. Um, in terms of flatness, that's just because I'm not used to speaking in, in that higher pitch tone. And Elsie's a lot more friendly. Eleanor is, she's not prickly, but she is... She's not as friendly as I'll see. She's friendly though. Especially, especially, yeah, I just, I don't know how to describe it. Um, I don't know how to describe it. Oh wait, we're going to Blackwater. That's this way. Yeah, I can see that. Like when I say hello, I <laughs> it's like hello or yeah, it's usually that. It's actually usually that. I try to make it a little more friendly, but it doesn't always come out that way. It doesn't always come out that way. I think I um I don't know. It's hard for me. Southern is really comfortable for me because it's it's pretty easy, and I'm not trying too hard. Um, so I don't have to think about it too much. But with Eleanor's voice, I have to think about it a little bit. With Amelia's, uh, that's British. I have to think about who's, who's following me. Or is it just echo echoes? Okay, anyway. Um, with Amelia, I definitely have to think about it a lot. Too much, actually. Uh, which is why she's always quiet. <laughs> because because for some reason, my, my mouth can only do quiet British. I can't do, like, the loud British for some reason. Even, like... When I try on stream and I can do it, but then when I have to RP, it's just like, can't, can't do it. Same with Irish. Irish, I usually go back into British or American, and it's not good. <laughs> I think I said a total of like three sentences on that character, and then I haven't played her since. Serena's voice is easier though, and the old man voice is also pretty easy. Hold on one second.
sorry about that. My husband had asked me a question. Okay, um, right, black water. Okay, let's get all my stuff back. To fix, to fix this. Oh, I actually have some stuff in my. Oh, that's right, it's rusty. But yeah, Serena's voice is easy because it's low. I don't have to think about that too much. Uh, Dexter's voice is also easy, it's just an old man voice. Uh, I think the trick is just keeping it up. <laughs> you know? Okay. Mm -hmm. We'll go to... how much money do I have? Oh, we're going to the bank. Reddish. Let's see what I put in your pockets. Ah, uh, you've got the lantern. Lantern. Oh. Shovel. That's a equestrian cafe. Um, oh, care. Okay. All right. <laughs> I was gonna be excited. I was like, wow, no way. Okay. Oh, good boy. And a good boy. Look at you. Oh, nice and clean. Oh, is that it? Yeah. Okay, so I don't have... What do I usually have? Mm. I gave all these things to Tibbet, right? The drink, the book. Was that all I had? And a 
I don't remember what I had. <laughs> okay, usually here is chicken feed, produce, chocolate. Alright, okay, and food. Okay, let's do that. Your hat's arbitrary. That's a, that's a rude, you know? Is there anyone in here? Can't see it so dark. Okay. Get two of these. Two of those. And four of these. Oh, no. And then. Why can't I move? Okay, there we go. I'll go get this. Ooh. Ooh. Custom paintings. Nice, nice. What about this one? Yeah. Where, where'd it go? Oh, there we go. Ammo Ranch hiring. Mm hmm.
So much fog. Oh, is nobody here? Oh, we got some. Hello there. Hello? Hello? Damn it. Yeah, okay. Is it just you here? So far. So far? Early bird wasn't... gets the worm? I wasn't told that it was cancelled or nothing, so I guess I was just early then. Alright. What are we selling today? Hey, did you ask me if it was me? Do you not recognize me, Timo? No, I said, hi, Clay. Can you hear me? Oh, okay. I, I swear to God I heard you say, is that you? Well, I say that for most people. <laughs> Did you just kiss your teeth? Huh? What? Did you just kiss your teeth? You? No, I didn't. I said, I no? do that for okay. most people. Uh, mm. I say, is that you? Because sometimes I think it's someone, and then it's not someone, and then I get embarrassed. Uh who else do you know that wears this much blue and white? Um, maybe Tibbet, but usually her blue is on top and the white is on the on her shirt, like a blue hat and a white shirt. I look nothing like Tibbet. I know, I know you don't, but you know sometimes people accidentally look like other people. You get into the you're, telling me, you're telling me that you've never run into someone and said, hey, you know, and you thought it was your friend. You said, hey, whatever your friend's name is. And then they say, oh, that's I'm not them. And then you go, oh, I'm so sorry. I thought you were my friend. I just say hello. They say hello. <laughs> if I don't recognize their voice, I go, oh, have we met before? <laughs> and then if they say, yeah, we have. It's me. I'm just like, oh, I'm so bad with faces. I'm sorry. <laughs> There's only been one woman that I ever did that to, and I mistook her for uh, Ranger Lucille, and I felt really bad, and I never did it again. I just, I'd rather people think I forgot who they were than uh, mistake somebody for someone they're not. I see. So how's it going? Ooh, more people. Uh, so far, so good. There's been nothing happening. I've just been sitting here. Not even uh, yesterday or the day before. I don't uh, these yes. Oh, I. I mean, I hit my head. You what? I hit my head pretty hard. Doing what? I got stitches. I was running from some wolves, and I oh. ran right into a tree. I got yeah. a minor concussion. Ouch. Feeling better today, though. Until I hit my head again, yep. <laughs> and then I had to go back to the doctor's office and 
I spoke to a doctor. They did a little checkup. They said it wasn't that bad. This doctor gave me some aspirin. And then uh, I went on my way. Ah, I see. Do you recognize these folks? Uh, one of them maybe is uh, Mr. Hemlock, Medic Hemlock, and uh, Doctor or Medic Emmett Mason. All right. So two doctors. Well, medics, but yeah. Oh, medics. People, people with medical knowledge. I know for sure that Mr. Hemlock only just became a medic, so he's definitely no doctor. As for Mr. Mason, I'm not actually sure. But I know he's the one spearheading the whole uh, wolf problem we're dealing with. Oh, right. I wonder what they're selling. No idea, but I have three boxes of lemons here. I'd, I, I would very much love to oh. sell every single lemon I have. Should we go advertise? Oh, good. Howdy, yeah. y'all. Hello, hello. How are y'all doing? Doing well. How about you all? Yeah, doing fancy. Good, good. Got lots of produce to sell today. Mm. Including yeah. lemons. Ooh. Nice. Well, I'm selling ice, so. Ooh, ice. Ooh. To make lemonade. So it looks like we're going to be making each other a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fingers crossed. Mm, hopefully, more people show up. I don't know. It's never actually. This has never happened before where it's the time and nobody's here. Mm. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing, actually. Mm. I never heard anything about any cancellations, so. No, me neither. Hmm. Uh, what are your all's names? Uh, Emmett Mason. Emmett Mason. Nice to meet you. Uh, I'm Atticus. Atticus. Oh, the same one that we met in Blackwater the other day? Yeah, the all very right. same. Nice to the see you again, same. Atticus. Great to see you. And I'm Cliff. Cliff Emlock. Cliff Emlock. Nice to meet you. Uh, hey. Mr. Mason, I heard that uh, you were the medic helping us uh, uh, figure out what was going on with the wolves. Out by Pronghorn. Uh, mm-hmm. Thank you for yep. that. Uh, yeah, no problem. Uh, oh, rider coming in. Hey, oh, two yeah, riders. Oh, look at that. Rooster! Rooster! Hi. Rooster? Yes, ma'am. How you doing? Hello. Hello doing well. Man. How are you? How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Finally made it to another market. Yes, I did. Finally. Crying oh, out loud. Oh, I was talking about me. Oh, you did? Oh, you? <laughs> Wait, you me? weren't there last weekend? I'm usually not here. <laughs> oh, okay. It's a special I thought... circumstance. Okay. Cause I... Wait. So I thought last weekend was the weekend that uh, you'd be starting to sell your books. Oh, yes, but uh, that's through um, Thomas Logan, not me. I mean, now that he no. has my books... Then no, I knew, I knew, I knew that, but I thought oh. you were going to be there to do it. Oh no, sorry, that was a, I didn't communicate that clearly. Oh okay, no, no, that's no problem at all. I just misunderstood. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But all right then. Well, it's good to see you here. Yeah, good to see you too. We're we're a little uh, short on people, it looks like. Clay, yeah, well, you you do... <laughs> I'm sorry. Let me get you a closer look there. <laughs> hey, how, how you doing, buddy? Doing all right. A little cool. tired. Been up since like three in the morning. What? Jesus Christ, why? Why do you do that to yourself? Hey, you think it's a choice? You think it's a choice? I, I do. I think it's a choice, and you need to cut that shit out. <laughs> <laughs> just falls asleep right here on the grass? Yes. <laughs> it's all right. Just let him sleep. Everyone will walk around him. Then we go, Clay, 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 <sighs> No, no, no. Clay. no let, let, I should, let the paper I boy should sleep. Probably, <laughs> I should probably be more careful with my head injury. That was probably a bad idea. Oh, yeah. Oh, do you want yeah. me to check it? Uh, no, that's well, okay. I guess I you have two legs over there, so you can 
have them check it. No, that's all right. I didn't Wait. hit my head, so I'm fine. But all right, okay. Wait, you have a head injury, but you didn't hit your head. Uh, just I didn't now hit my head he, ju just then when, he, when I oh, fell. Oh, oh, fell oh, right, okay. I more so fell on my shoulder. My shoulder's uh -huh. covered in dirt. And this is my uh, my church outfit, so. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, Wait, you're going to have to get that cleaned. I will. God damn it, Clay. <laughs> just, a, just a cowboy a cowboy bath, it's fine. Yeah, <laughs> rub some dirt on it. Who's the yeah, fellow so that, no. that uh, came in? The other fellow behind you. The Will Driscoll? Mm. Uh, yeah, yeah, the one that was uh, this horse. That's Dr. Uh, Connor McNamara. Oh, another doctor. Oh, Connor. Connor's a good guy. Yeah. He's helped Ruby a bunch of times. And uh, actually, what, what was it? Just recently. Oh, uh, I signed up to be a blood donor. And uh, he saw that no one had taken care of it. So he telegrammed me to let me know that he took care of it for me. Oh, <laughs> neat. Yeah, nice. he's a good guy. Uh, now you see, we, we've been running into some issues, right? There's like, every single time the market finishes, there's always this issue that me and Roby have noticed now. Um, mm -hmm. Our boxes are always missing one singular item hmm. every single time we go back. Interesting. Someone's so stealing our shit. Someone is taking a singular piece of produce and running away. Uh -huh. So just keep keep a, keep a close eye on it. All right, I will do that. If if it happens again today, I just saw I just saw either I saw somebody come from our boxes and run behind, uh, walk behind the circus area back there. Should we check them now? Mm, good. The um potato box isn't very full, and I've got some labeled, some not. That's when most people are the oh. uh, lemon. About... Sorry. Well, I was gonna say, where is Ruby showing up? Because uh, we still gotta we gotta sell those lemons. I've got three boxes of lemons. Hell yeah, all right. That one's okay. Still have all my potatoes. Potatoes! <laughs> Still have all the celery and beets. Okay, there's more carrots in there. Lemons are fine. Seems like we're okay so far. Yeah, we've got to wait for the market to get more busy, and then uh, then we keep a deeper eye. Yeah, it's oddly quiet. And when I got here, there was nobody here. I was by myself. Is that not normal? No. no. I mean, Usually it's... there's at least like one or two people waiting here uh, before 12. Yeah, yeah. But, I mean, it's only 10 after. People do end up showing up late sometimes. But I'm sure it'll be fine. Yeah, what watch it watch it happen that the one time we get a shit ton of lemons, absolutely no one shows up. <laughs> Wait, maybe there's um, a we could check the newspaper, see if there's something else happening today. Mr. Oh. Uh, Mason over there is selling ice, so Oh, all right. All right. People are gonna be jumping back and forth. You got two Fingers rare wrong. things showing up. Oh wait, who's his wagon? Nobody. Oh, Nobody. Wait. Maybe. Who knows? I wonder if you need only lemon, ice, and sugar to make lemonade, right? Uh, I have maybe. no idea. Maybe. It sounds about right. Howdy. Howdy. Is that you, Connor? Yeah, it is. Howdy, Howdy. Connor. How you Hello. doing? Hello. Doing all right. How are you? Doing well, doing well. Hey, I wanted to thank you. Uh, I think I already did send you a telegram, but thanks again for uh, speeding up my um, blood donor. Oh, yeah, ab absolutely. Um, thanks for donating uh, or uh, being eligible to, to donate and agreeing to, you know, do so. Yeah, yeah, no it's problem at all. But, yep, you're, you're on the list, so nothing else. I'm on that list. Called up, but uh, given everything going up near Pronghorn, uh, definitely a good thing to have uh, donors. If he's speaking, I can't hear him. Oh, uh, speak up. Yep. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I, I'm uh, the one thing I'm known for is probably talking way too quiet. It's oh, well, okay. the man to your uh, left is known for talking way too loud. Yeah, oh, yeah, so together, together. Mm -hmm. yeah. powers yeah, right. together, combined. Rooster will be heard, and I will be uh, maybe somewhere in the background. Rooster yes. can repeat everything you say for everyone to yeah, hear. That, that, that works. 
<laughs> By the time that shit's gotten me in trouble, goddamn, I swear to God. <laughs> but yeah, so uh, you uh, interested in any produce? We have lemons today. I I was directed over here because my strategic Ooh. lemon reserve is um you know gone. So I I should probably end up picking up some more. I was debating going over to Guarma, but if you've got them here, that uh, would save me a trip. We did the uh-huh. Guarma trip for you. Go ahead and buy whatever you need. Yeah, how much do you need? We've got plenty. Um, do you have a crate's worth? Yeah. Okay. Um, how much would that be going for? Uh, let me do the math. Oh, by the way, uh, Connor, I don't think we've met. I'm Eleanor. I work with oh, these two. Um, gotcha. Very nice to meet you, Eleanor. Um, nice to meet you, too. My name's, uh, Connor McNair, I'm a uh, medic with the Department of uh, Health. Nice to meet you. you hear that rooster? We the, we're these two. <laughs> That's right. That's right. We're That's the pronghorn the... boys is who we are. I mean, I could have said these two knuckleheads, <laughs> these two little yeah. potatoes, these two. You we're want me to continue? Just a couple of ding-dongs. <laughs> <laughs> it's the uh, technical title. Yep. $200, Connor. Okay. Um... Just so I don't have to walk back towards town. Do you mind just give me a moment? I'll just grab my wagon and uh, be right back. Yeah, it's no problem at all. Perfect. You got Thank it. You. Yeah, by the way, I was a little surprised. Uh, no one else from Pronghorn seemed to be interested in uh, joining the blood don- donor uh, list. I was meaning to do it, but so many of you ran into the medical office when it was happening. that uh, So many. It was me and Blanche, and that was it. <laughs> I could have sworn somebody else did that. I could have sworn there was three of you. Uh, I think Rhett was in there at the time, uh, but that was that was it. No one else went in at all, and I was just kind of. What day was this? Mm. Uh, when was that? Something something happened to Rhett, and I think we all went to the medical office oh. with Blanche to uh, make sure he was okay. Was it with Rhett that it happened, or was that when Tess got attacked by that bear? I um... don't remember. Because if it was when Tess got attacked by that bear, I was that was when I got like really upset with Libetti, so I was in my head. That sounds... See, I think I was around for the time that the bear thing happened, but I don't think I was... I can't remember. We were treasure hunting. Oh. That was a long oh, time ago. yes. No, I do. Yes, yes, yes. That was because of test getting attacked by the bear. That was what it was. Oh, okay. Okay, and yeah, I was, I was in my head because Libetti pissed me off. Yep, yep. How's that going, by the way? It looks like she's talking to you again. That's good. Uh, for the most part, but now uh, I breathe the wrong way and something's wrong with me for some reason. Yeah. Wait, what do you mean something's wrong with her? Like she's worried that you're mad at her again? Mm-hmm. Oh, Christ, okay. God damn. That, that girl is so frustrating. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to talk to her and tell her just... If there's a problem, just talk it out and, and, and all that sort of thing. And now she's terrified of you. I don't know what the hell happened there. Neither do I. What? But I, I had a small talk with her and I told mm-hmm. her that she doesn't need to walk her, walk around me like she's stepping on eggshells. Yeah, no, not at all. I told her that she could be herself while still being careful and cautious. Exactly. Exactly. I tried to tell her that too. Yeah. I think she's trying. It's just sometimes it takes a lot to change. And I understand that. I know it takes time, but that it just, I don't know. It just uh, surprises me a little bit. So when you got so many people uh, telling her that we're on her uh, side, not on her side necessarily, but we have her back and that we, we understand how she is and all that kind of thing. You just, you just have to, you know, communicate with people a little bit better. And now she's terrified. <laughs> Yeah, well, if you think about it, I mean, I don't, I mean, you two seem to know her very, very well, so I'm assuming you know what her parents were like. She told me a little bit about that. So I can see her having a lot of issue, first accepting that she was wrong, because she's been expected to be perfect her whole life, and then being willing to communicate is not something she's used to. Yeah. Yeah, it's fair. I'm not saying it's not frustrating, because it is. You know, mm. you just want her to say, like, hey, we care about you. And if you could be a little more careful, that'd be great. But uh, right, I right. think because of 
she's still growing up and she's still learning and it's not easy to admit you're wrong. So I'm even impressed that she did that. So what, I'm sorry, it's not easy to admit you're wrong and then what? So I'm impressed that she did that, admitted oh, that yeah. she was wrong. Yeah, yeah absolutely. I right. could have went very differently if she didn't. Yeah, it would have. I just, uh, I just hope she sees the the love that people have for for her, and that uh, that we actually care and we're not getting on her. We're just worried about her. I think she will eventually. Just have to keep loving her. Yeah. No, of course. I swear, oh, I'm one of the. Sammy. Few, oh, was that? Who's that? I think that's Sammy. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And I don't and recognize who that is. Uh, Therese Richter, it looks like. Oh, okay. Uh, Therese Richter? Like oh, is that a ranger? It's a ranger. Oh, okay. Oh, and I, then I, I think, think Imogen came, too. Oh, yeah, yeah, Imogen's yeah. over there. I'm gonna go grab these lemons. All right. Yep. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Sammy. What was that? Hello. Hi, Sammy. How y'all doing? Hi. Hello. Uh, 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 Eleanor and it, Rooster, yes? I think you briefly met, but this is Therese. Oh, okay. Uh, she Hello, Therese. is uh, my, Sorry. Uh, <laughs> one of my two closest friends in the whole wide world. Uh, she's like family to me. Uh, she's also living uh, at Pronghorn for the moment, uh, 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 sleeping in my room. Uh, oh, okay. Also, game. Oh, also, she's game warden. Um, wouldn't mind it. Oh, Hi. game warden. No. Hello. Oh, game yeah, warden. Oh, very okay. recently. Yes. Like I said. Oh, congratulations. It's and it's going to yeah, be two hundred dollars. Yeah. No oh, yeah. All of you have a good game warden now. <laughs> oh, good, good. Perfect. Thank, Thank God. I was, I was hoping one day yeah. I'd have a pocket game <laughs> warden. <on my> <laughs> She how's, the, how's the squirrels doing squirrel nowadays? <laughs> <laughs> I'm currently more looking uh, yeah, at the bears and wolves, but that's okay. It might be a normal thing, it may okay. not, it's more on the exotic okay. side of things. Yeah, that is, yeah that's, that's, yeah, that is important. Mm -hmm. With these damn rabies issues. Yeah. Yeah. She uh, she was the ranger okay. that I telegrammed you, everyone, Thanks. about when about like sending in tips and stuff about uh, wolf behavior and stuff before yeah, we got that. confirmed about the rabies. Yep, mm -hmm. yep. Yeah. Yeah, it, it's all in the files. But, yeah. <laughs> Swear to God, I, on the way up here from Pronghorn, I actually ran into two different packs of wolves. Oh. It's just, I don't even bother to stop and shoot anymore. I just ride the hell away. I don't want to take any chances. Yeah, I understand mm -hmm. that. Oh, it's a question. There's not a lot of people here. No, there, there isn't. When, when I got here, it was just Clay. And I think I was on time. Was I on time? Yeah, you were. Yeah. I was surprised. You were like two minutes early. I was five minutes late and still. <laughs> Maybe people don't realize that it's technically an hour earlier. Oh. People might. Could be happening a lot. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Interesting. I think that I think that that might be why. Huh. Okay. Hmm. People are like, you know, like twelve. Yeah, twelve. <laughs> technically, it's at eleven, but it's actually twelve. But it's you know. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that can be really confusing. Mm-hmm. Oh, but so yes, the unrelated question I was going to ask, um, Therese is, is it true that Sammy is your, uh, um, unofficial, official, unofficial secretary? <laughs> yes. Oh. Yes, that they are. <laughs> yes. <laughs> they, they have a blue poncho on some of their outfits for oh. the official, unofficial secretary duty. But how, it, yep. how dare you question <laughs> me, Eleanor? Listen, I'm just fact-checking, okay? How dare you? <laughs> also, it's very good to see you. Good to see you too. Yes, no, that that title is uh, is only one, one and only, and I have full power. <laughs> yeah, sure, definitely <laughs> full power. Full power of a table. secretary. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, especially now that I'm a unofficial, official, unofficial secretary for a game warden, <laughs> I have even more power. <laughs> All the power. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Unlimited power. The power of the squirrel. My my favorite thing <laughs> oh my is God, to haze r recruits. <laughs> Wait, what? It's my favorite thing is to haze recruits. 
Why is that? What, in what wait. manner? Yeah, what are Just you giving doing? them a hard time? <laughs> <laughs> well, technically, you're a new recruit, Pronghorn. Shouldn't we give you a hard time then? I've been a uh, recruit for like four months. <laughs> Bullshit, because that's as long as I've been here. Okay, three months then. <laughs> same as, well, same, I don't, hmm. I mean, maybe it's just because you were around at different times I was around, but it seems like you've only really been around Pronghorn for about maybe two, maybe less. I, no, I've been around for, I. I'll, I, I'll give Sammy this. They have been working at uh, Pronghorn for quite a while, but yeah. it was mainly as like a temporary day worker and not as like a, mm -hmm. like a white hat. Right, right. Trainee or whatever. Yeah, I start. I, I, yeah. That that started around like a li a bit before you. I think maybe you arrived uh, to Pronghorn Clay because when I when I was uh, working there from time to time, when the job boards weren't in, on the ranches, uh, and I got to go to Pronghorn and stuff, uh, it was only Thomas. And then suddenly I met Ruby. Uh, when she was setting up the prong on produce stuff. Uh, and then, you know, the job boards came in and stuff, and then I just started working there regularly. But I only was around for, like, the early hours for most of the time because I didn't really know there was a lot of other people. I knew there was a person named Rooster, but I'd never met him. I just <laughs> heard about Rooster, and I heard him snoring through the bunkhouse almost every <laughs> time I went there. Hell yeah. <laughs> Clay was sleeping on that chair outside all the time. You expect me to sleep inside the... <laughs> no. <laughs> Listen, people get used to it. Yeah. And then I stayed up for a little longer, and then I met everyone else slowly, but surely. What they're saying is that the uh, sleep schedule that we cultivated for them is entirely fucked now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, indeed. Yes. I got out of bed maybe... Three hours ago. Ah, uh, well, I woke up at uh, three in the morning, so my sleep schedule has never been great. Well, your sleep schedule, yeah, yeah, I, you, yours might actually be worse than mine. Oh well, I can I can stay awake for thirty hours and prove it to you. Don't do that. Well, you don't have to. I just I I I believe you. I believe you. You ain't got nothing to prove. Go to sleep. <laughs> I did it a this couple is days not ago. Something to brag about. Yeah. Christ Almighty, we need you to work. We don't need you to have dead. <laughs> That's all we care about is when you work. <laughs> Thanks, yeah. Rooster. I love you too, buddy. Love you too. Where are people? Don't, I, 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 I bet you, ever since you brought it up, I, I think that uh, now we're going to probably see him showing up maybe around uh, one. <laughs> Uh, is there a sink here? Yes, there is. Uh, yeah, yes. behind Other side the of our... wagon. Yeah, right over here. Okay. I don't want to go down to the river. <laughs> oh, not going to be a squeeze in there, are you? Oh, oh. <laughs> Holy shit, Sammy. You're so strong. <laughs> whoa. Whoa, whoa. What the hell? <laughs> God damn. <laughs> I think that horse might be a little bit protective of them. Yep. <laughs> She's got a trained attack, to attack horse. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> she just gets jealous. Mm -hmm. uh -huh, uh -huh. She gets very jealous. Okay. Yeah, when, I, when I was in a relationship, uh, that's when she started kicking me. The first time she oh. ever kicked me was when she kicked me and my ex-partner at the same time. Oh lord! And then continued to kick me throughout my relationship with her, and then after we broke up, she has only kicked me like once. <laughs> so, but and that's only been when, when she's been like freaked out. Otherwise, she's never kicked me again. <laughs> Who? I don't think I've ever seen a twofer before. I got kicked with wh whoever else that was the other day, and uh, Strawberry. Were, were you there for that? I don't think so. Yeah, me and was it you, Clay? No. No, it was not a, the other day, anyway. Yeah, I don't remember who the hell that was, but I've never seen so, like two people get kicked by a horse at the same exact time. That was that was special. If I get kicked by the horse, I'm fucked. Yeah, and well, fall, no. falling off a horse and hitting my head was enough to just. Woo. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 
amount of times I've been hit in the head or gotten knocked out, I'm getting a little worried. <laughs> I don't about having that happen more. Mm. I hit the tree real hard. Yeah, no, I know. That happens too much to you and everybody. Yeah, the forest behind Pronghorn is deadly. Mm hmm. So, are all the people that we're seeing now, are all of them vendors? I think so. I don't know about that woman standing in front of the. Uh... Yeah, I don't see her. Oh. Oh. That's who? Maddie. Yep. That's Maddie? Mm hmm. Oh. Am I supposed to know who Maddie is? She's game a game warden. Medicine, never mind. One of my very Never met her. Never, never even heard of her. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to say it like that. <laughs> She's I don't know who she is. She doesn't matter. Know her. <laughs> I hate her already. I don't know her. <laughs> Whatever. Sammy, did you bake any goods? Uh, unfortunately, I was very. I've been very busy helping with an event that I'm catering for Ooh. today. Uh, and also, uh, Sheriff uh, Wild put in an order for baked goods, so I spent all of yesterday doing that. So sadly, this week, no baked goods. Oh, but next okay. week, I will bring baked goods. Oh, Alrighty. If it makes you feel any better, you cooked a whole box up for Rooster, and he let it rot. <laughs> yeah, they know. People... <laughs> You've never Actually, let they, anyone it, fucking forget about it. Jesus No, Christ. no, you I, shouldn't it, forget about it because I made that with love and care and affection and you, you let it rot. Yep, I'll I have did you it know, on purpose too. Fuck your cook. I'll, <laughs> I'll have you know somebody somebody cleaned out that box. Yep. As they, moldy and stinky as it was. Oh, no. oh yeah. The bottom of the box was yellow and green oh. and there was like uh, like it was very clear because people kept taking them, even though there was a note there. So I took some labels and just plastered a label on them that, you know, moldy. Yeah. No, people, yeah. people still took them. People are hungry, I guess. Mm -hmm. if, if you're that desperate, I'll give you a dollar. Go get us two. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Lord. I know, yeah, people still wanted the baked goods, I guess. And the crate is gone. Someone took the crate, too. Well, oh, I no. expected that, yeah. Yeah. Wait, and where was note. this crate? Someone took the crate and the note. Oh, no. <laughs> then they licked the box clean. Uh, I don't think there's anything that can make that box clean. Uh, I hope they burnt it. Oh, look, it's frosted. Mm. Uh, mm. <laughs> Oh, by the way, Rooster, I told uh, I told Blanche of your upcoming adventures with Crosby. Wait, what? Wait, wait, your, what do you mean? Up your outlaw adventure? adventures with Crosby. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what, what was his name? Stud something. Stud Rider. His name was Stud. Stud? Rider. His name yes. is Stud Rider, and I'm Cock Johnson. We're oh, partners no. in outlaw. Wait, it's, yep. wait, Crosby's name is Stud. Yes, yep. Crosby's right. name is Stud Rider, and then <laughs> Rooster is Cut Johnson, and they're yes. gonna go out on adventures, but on separate horses, and five feet apart because they're just friends. Yeah, he may give me a massage every now and again, but oh it's just because he's my friend. We might and sleep he... shirtless together, but that don't mean nothing. He just needs to stay warm. The hell are you looking at? They were roommates, huh? <laughs> That's it, just roommates. And, and and when oh. they do a good job, they give a encouraging slap on the butt. Oh my gosh. That's right. <laughs> but nice because they're friends and they support each other. What an assless chaps <laughs> a slap right on the ass. <laughs> <laughs> Who's writing this book? Uh, I don't know, but there's you know that there is a um, there's a there's a note always in, in Strawberry saying an author author looking for inspiration. <laughs> I've uh me and Ruby, we couldn't breathe how much we were laughing. <laughs> oh, it's Quinn. You think she wants produce? 
Maybe. Hi, Queen. Howdy, howdy. Hello, you. Hello. I've got an outfit for you for later for the event. <laughs> so I'll do show it to you after. Oh, yes. Do you, do you mind if I uh, do you mind if I steal Therese with me as well so she can see it? Yeah, yeah, of course. Howdy. It's fun. Howdy. 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 Oh, do you, guys, do you guys want to go? I got it from Hattie. Oh, Connor, is you? Holy shit. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah I'll take recognize it. you with your coat. Hattie. Hattie Rhodes. Lives in Rhodes. Kind of who's distance. a hat maker. It is. Yeah, Hattie Rhodes. Mm -hmm. Um. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I'll take it. Do you want, do you want some produce? Um, I'm mm -hmm. not actually do that. Uh, let me think. You. We have lots of lemons. <laughs> mm -hmm. Lots and lots of lemons. Fella. Give me the coffee, oh. fella. And beets and Christ. celery and uh, carrots and potatoes and eggs. I'm not take some potatoes and Ooh, eggs. Potatoes. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I'll, I'll try to hand you. Wait, wait, wait. Um, um, if you, if you, how many have you got and how much uh, would it be again? Oh, well, you didn't tell me I that. Oh, have, we have a whole crate full of eggs. Um, okay. And then we have... Is it a whole crate full of potatoes too, Clay? No, no, we have maybe mm, twenty-two, twenty-three potatoes. <laughs> you have a good one, okay. so How much is twenty potatoes? Sorry, uh, I do this every week. I'm a fucking, yeah. I'm an asshole. I, I, I come yeah, up here I and then I buy so much of it, and then it's like if anyone else comes to the market, they're like, "Oh, can I buy potatoes?" And it's like, "Sorry, oh, we shit. only have three because it. Quinn the dickhead just took them all." <laughs> no. <laughs> Well, howdy, Miss Harper. I do apologize for not saying hello sooner. Uh, it is two dollars <laughs> per potato. Okay. Uh, nope, nope. If you try and pay for coffee, so you don't get coffee. For twenty <laughs> potatoes, let okay. me do the math I'll, I'll because I refuse to do it in my head. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you guys have a good day. Okay. Thank hey, you. you too. Don't worry about buying the the produce. Uh, so two, so two, and then twenty. So that'll be forty. Is that right? Mm-hmm. It would be forty dollars. <laughs> yeah. I, th I think it is. You've been dealing with math, math this entire week, Quinn. You should know, be better at it now. No, <laughs> look, I didn't go to school, okay? Neither did I, I don't feel bad. Yeah. Are you buying us out again so everyone gets pissed at us? Yeah, kind of maybe. A little bit. Man, we hate bit. money. <laughs> <laughs> and maybe we do have do a system that. where they can put orders and pick them up at a later time. Oh, that's true. Plus, uh. Anybody got so... labels? Uh, yeah, I'll definitely no. take, um, I've got two labels, is that enough? I'm gonna give you a very odd baggie full of stuff, <laughs> if I don't have any labels. Here, here's, um, here's the labels. Thank there you, you kind of course. Um, I'll have to go down to the bank to actually get the money anyhow, um, but I can bring my wagon up if that's easier, or... Um, whatever works. Probably bring my wagon up, Rob. Right? Are you gonna buy crates? Depending how many you're getting. Uh, oh yeah, I might be able to hold it. I'll go get money at the bank as soon as I know how much. Alright. Um, yeah, I'll buy as many eggs as you're willing to part with without <laughs> taking away the eggs that other we, people might No, want. we're here to... The, what you see here is we're willing to part with all of it. First yeah, come, first serve. come first serve. Yeah, so yeah don't but, then, but then what about the other poor people? Well, if they, they want eggs, they can order. Yeah. Um, okay, let, let me... Uh, I'll get you the money first. I'll go to the bank. So, how many eggs... How much would a crate of eggs cost? <laughs> God, I'm addicted. Well, let me, oh, let me. What? No, you're not. <laughs> oh, you're fine. You're giving us good business. Yeah. You're helping us, really. Well, yeah, we're not going to say no to your money. <laughs> it's uh, $9 per dozen. There's mm -hmm. about eight dozens in here, so that's going to be about $72. Oh, All right, so 72 Uh, So let me see. 70. 40. 80, 90, 100, 110, plus two, is that what you said? Yeah, it's going to be $112, 112 for that, that all that. Yep, yep. I can do that. Right, I'll go Perfect. get the money. I'll be right back. Alright, after she hands me that, I'm going to have uh, $400 on me. Uh, you should uh, probably put that in the bank. Oh no. I only came here with like 60 
Hi, folks. Hello. Hey. Howdy, Miss Blackwell. Hi, uh, I'm all right. Uh, does anybody have any um, book returns for this week? I chain. Uh, are, are you in sore need of books? Because I, I still haven't read the one I have. No, no, that's all right. I just was asking. You take okay. your time. Read. read oh, your... oh, I, I can actually get you a bunch of. I so I bought a bunch of books from uh, Logan a what a while ago, oh, but I really? still have them. Okay, uh, I have read them, but I just have them. So if you want, <gasps> I, I, I would be happy to you. donate them to the library. I will, I will buy them from you, Sammy. I would love okay. to do that. Yeah. yeah. Oh, my God, that would be great. Yeah, because... we can do that after the market if, if that's fine. Yeah, that's totally fine. I, mm -hmm. I have time. Uh, we are running low on stock, so I'm very glad you said that. Yeah. Um, also, I've it, been It's like trying... four, four or five books, I think. Yes. Oh, that's so exciting. Ooh. And Atticus just got his own wagon. So now we have Ooh. two wagons for the library, <sighs> which is very exciting. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Uh, I, I do, unfortunately, have a, a tiny bit of news um, for market uh, reasons. Uh, I have heard some pretty disturbing things about Mr. Logan. Have you all heard that stuff as well? I have not. No. He's been no. robbing folk. Yeah, that's what I've heard. What? I, I, I have heard, and I, I defended him for the first little while, and then, unfortunately... Uh, I, I got some. I got a pretty damning telegram um, from from the pastor in Valentine. Okay, uh, um, oh. I wanna I wanna make sure you know this. The pastor in Valentine is known to make thing a situation much worse. Okay, he, that's good to know. That's he, good to know. He is known to spread rumors, and uh, Quinn's sister. Uh, so there was some kind of altercation in the in Valentine. And the pastor made it so much worse that the aggressor beat Quinn's sister uh, blue and bloody. Oh, my. Jesus. Because he oh. just made the situation much worse. So I, before you take that as fact from, what, you know, from the pastor, I would maybe verify with others before you take his word on it. So, so that's exactly what I did. So the first time he told me about it, he told me here at the market while Mr. Logan was standing there talking to a deputy. And I went... You know, I've known Mr. Logan for a very long time, and I know he does the security company, and I know that, like, you know, there are two sides to everything, and people can be, you know, he could be working, and somebody uh -huh. might take it the wrong way and twist it. And I said, so with respect, I'm, I'm going to look into it first before I make my decision. Uh, but unfortunately, uh, his actions were confirmed uh, by other people oh. um, that he's been, you know, Rob, I haven't had a chance to talk to him about it. Uh, so, but I would very much love to give him the benefit of the doubt. Uh, so I, I, I don't know if he's just got caught up in something or if somebody hired him and he can't get out of the contract or what, but I, I have heard some disturbing things, which is all I want to say. Uh, he's still welcome here. I'd still like to talk to him and get his side of things, Sure. you know, but I, I thought I would let y'all know. This is Mr. Thomas like, Logan? Yep. Yeah, uh -huh. before somebody's like, hi, Mr. Logan, and then he robs you or something, you know? So if you hear anything or if anything happens, please do feel free to let me know. And the second thing is um, there is unfortunately uh, an individual who means to do me and Atticus harm. Um, she has uh, long hair tied back in a braid. Um, she wears uh, a, a red corset uh, and... Uh, oh, and a red mask? Red yes, mask. that's right. Oh, That's yeah, right. yeah. I know. Who, who is that yeah. person? Uh, well, her, 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 she goes by the name of Ani. Uh, so if, if you do happen to see her lurking around uh, the, uh, the market oh, or Blackwater or anything, you know, please, you know, just keep your, your eyes open because uh, she, she has been very vocal about her intent to do uh, Mr. Atticus and I uh, she's, bodily harm. She's been up at Pronghorn recently. Yeah, be I, very I, careful. I okay. thought she, uh, she she was only after like deputies and stuff. Oh, I'm just I'm that is correct. She she used to only be after deputies and only after male deputies. Thank you. But Thank you, unfortunately, uh, Mr. Atticus and I have a little bit of history with her, and um, you did not have room in your wagon, so I just kind of moved uh, those milk bottles over for you. The uh, uh, the it's 112. Did you already give the money to somebody? Yeah. Uh, uh, Sorry, it's so hard for me to speak while other voices no, okay. are around me. I no, find myself just listening. I'm sorry. Yep, yep, yep. Um, uh, the and I'm, I'm not trying to alarm anybody, but the telegram I got was from a from a detective telling me to take precautions to because her threats 
were taken seriously enough at the law department that they felt it necessary to telegram myself and Atticus a warning. Understood. So, yeah. Okay. All right. I appreciate that's the warning. The main, yeah, that's the main bulk of that. So um, otherwise, let's have a good morning. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like things get, get crazy very quickly all the time. Mm. Yeah. If you have a minute, yeah. uh, Miss Imogen, I'd like to speak with you privately. Oh, sure. We do that now? Sure. You look radiant today, and I just want to tell you that. Oh. Thank you. I appreciate it, Okay, what's up? Well, I appreciate the warning about uh, Mr. Logan. It does concern me quite a bit since I've entrusted him with two books of mine. Uh, so my understanding is that the, the robbing is nothing to do with the market and hasn't affected any of the library or anything? Uh, well, other than the fact that I can't seem to get books. Uh, oh, okay. You know, like I've been trying to buy extra copies for... Uh, for the library, so uh, yeah, uh, I don't want to compete with mm -hmm. uh, Mr. Logan's uh, publishing company, but Atticus and I have decided to go ahead and maybe look into starting one as well. Uh, so I, I wouldn't feel comfortable taking any books that he used to that he does still publish or used to publish, uh, unless he relinquishes those rights. But any new books that you write, if you feel like you want to maybe look at. Um, publishing with us then that's something that we could do uh but yeah it is it is something i've been trying to get in touch with him about because i i don't want to believe it to be true but i've heard from multiple people now and i i'm afraid unfortunately uh, it, it does appear to be true oh that's very disappointing yeah i was really hoping to give back to the market with those books yeah well i'm i'm, I'm holding out as best i can and and perhaps there is still you know, room for change or, or for error, I guess. I see. I'm holding out help because he's been very good to us in the library, so. Okay. Well, here's the thing then. Um, if you're able to talk with him and if mm -hmm. he's still willing to give you those books and you're willing to receive them for the library and, or for selling here, uh, I'm, I'm still okay with that. You know, granted that uh, his character is, is put in check. Now, uh, if you would like to publish those same books and you're able to get him to agree to, to transfer the copyrights, I would also be okay with that. And it'd be the same kind of deal. You would take all proceeds and, and just put it back into the market. Okay. Yeah, I can, I can handle that. Well, I mean, I don't... I guess we would sell books, too. I didn't I guess even so. think about that. Yeah. Oh, and combine it with like a kind of bookstore slash library sort of deal? It, yeah, I guess so. I guess so, but I, I think don't it's, see why. it could still work. Yeah, if people want to borrow and they don't. They want to return it, right? Because sometimes uh, books take up a lot of space. Yeah, yeah, and sometimes they want to buy a copy as a gift as mm -hmm. well. So exactly. maybe they could do special order or something like that. Something like that. Yeah. Okay. Yep. All right. That's not a bad idea then. All right. Well, do you mind okay. if I give you my telegram and you keep me updated on the situation? Uh, no, I don't feel uh, weird about that at all. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. All right. It's Eastern Sunset, 888, ES888. And that's Eleanor Clark, E-L-E-A-N-O-R, space C-L-A-R-K. Okay. And I, I usually can't make the market that frequently, but uh, if you have any news that you'd last, like to pass along, feel free to send a telegram. Uh, if if you want, you can also let Clay or Rooster know I trust both of them. Or Sammy. Okay. I trust, him t I trust her too. Okay. Do you happen to have a library card already? I don't. That was the second question I was going to ask. Okay. Yeah. So I, I can I can put you down for that and make sure that you've got a library card as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. Uh, how much okay. do I owe you for that? Nothing. Cause Are you sure? You've do yeah, you've donated books. So okay. Absolutely. It's, it's my pleasure. All right. Sounds good. Thank you so much. Yeah, of course. Thank you for letting me know, and thank you for continuing to support the library. It means a lot. Of course. I, I love books. <laughs> <laughs> it was just a very cute, way, a cute <laughs> statement. I love books. I mean, I do. <laughs> yeah. The way they smell, 
the way they can transport you to another world. Yeah, me too. I, I feel like they're very much needed right now as well. Absolutely. I feel in my like life, but yeah, in general. For everyone, the crossing is a very, well, it's filled with a lot of stuff. Dangerous yeah. stuff and beautiful things too. Yeah, and when the dangerous stuff feels a bit overwhelming, it's nice to have somewhere to retreat to. Absolutely. All right, I won't take up much right. more of your time. Yeah, thank, thank you, Miss Clark. Yes, of course. All right. No, I can't. <laughs> yeah, 15, and she was right, it's 15 no. Oh, hell, 15, well, okay. I'm, I'm pretty shit at math, so I'm going to be riding that, call, that high all day. Look at you. You're better than us. I'll give you a little extra. Right. How about that? Well, I'll meet you in the middle between mm -hmm. what uh, what the failure said and what I said. Thank you, Connell. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll be okay. You Hello, Maddie. How are you? I'm doing all right. Good, good. And, yeah, I'm enjoying it. I don't often go off duty or socialize, so this is new. <laughs> well, Welcome to socializing. Back, if any of you come back next week, I, uh, I'll make sure that there's some baked goods here as well. Ooh, well, I have an event coming up in April that I wanted to run by you too, so. Ooh. Really? Mm-hmm. I would love to, if, if you want to cater for, for that, I would love to help out. Yeah, we'll definitely need one because it's going to be a fun one. It, uh, it's going to be for the late Joey Crawford. And um, oh. he was a hell of a fun feller. So oh. we're going to be having a nice fun shindig and a oh. camp out for that one. All right. <laughs> you want one or two crates, do you think? Mm, maybe Joe. two. Okay, I'm not half... then I'll make... Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'll make sure to get all of the things that I would need for that then. Okay. I uh, I think second week of April is when we're reckoning. Okay. Wonderful. And how's the ranch ranching going? Pretty good, I'd say. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Besides from the rabid wolves? Uh, right. So far, so good. <laughs> yeah, that's... Uh... That's a fun little uh, hitch mm -hmm. we have, but uh, otherwise everything's great. Yeah. We, no we rabbit had, we holes will keep scare. us down. Yeah. Right. <laughs> we had Sorry, we sorry. had a little scare with one of our uh, one of our people, but luckily it it not it uh, it was nothing. Oh, good. You got folks getting invested with spats and leather jackets. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, wearing winter coat in the middle of in the middle of spring, but <laughs> yep. whatever keeps my skin clear from wolf mouths. Yeah, yeah, Eleanor. I don't know if, if were you told about Crosby. No, what happened? Oh, no. he, he um uh, he was uh, he was uh, nicked by a wolf, <gasps> uh, but it was closer to strawberry than it was pronghorn, but still went to uh, medics immediately. Uh, Fletcher came uh, to. Uh, to check him out, and then we went over to check the uh, the wolf itself, and uh, he determined that the wolf is most likely not rabid, but you know okay. it's still important to keep an eye out. But it's still it was still so far away from the ranch that it's probably not anything to be afraid of. Hi, Ellie. How are you doing? Doing good. Do you want some uh, produce from Pronghorn? Um. We have lemons as well. I have. Probably uh, a little, maybe maybe seventy dollars to my name. So I think I'm gonna have to hold until next week. Anything you want, I, I can get it. <laughs> I'm okay. Don't worry, Julia. Sure. Mm-hmm. All right. Howdy, Ellie. Howdy, Juliet. Howdy. It's good to Ellie. see you. Ellie. How's it's Ranger going you. with you? Ranger is going. Very well. Um, I am buried under paperwork, though. So oh, yeah. Self-inflicted. Um, so I'm, I'm... Every time I clock in duty, a little piece of my soul dies as I write file after file after file. Oh, God. Why are you doing that to yourself? Because I think she has to. It's, it's, it's such a good project. If it works, it's going to be so good. It's just... 
It's just so much. Are you able to say what the project is? <laughs> um, well, um, I am planning on making a heat map of every place people get injured in state using data that other rangers give me. So oh, that it'll help make wow. uh, search and rescues in the future easier because, <laughs> well, there'll Dope. be like priority areas to check first, you know? If everyone keeps getting injured at this wolf den, in this part of the, you know, state, in this search area, um, well, that's the first place you should check when there's a, when, when someone's injured out there. Yeah, mm -hmm. I remember you, you talked about that. Okay, good. And it'll also hopefully give trends on, like, what's the biggest danger in each area of the crossing? If there's, you know, a ton of wolf attacks in the past two months in one area, like, let's say, Pronghorn, um, we could do culling projects to try and, you know, lower the population or uh, do, like, outreach programs to, like, educate people that, hey, this is a high-risk area. I don't mean to interrupt, but I just wanted to do some follow-up um, uh, re Mr. Logan. Oh. And uh, I, I have reason to believe he's working with the law. Like, that all of the things he was doing was... You know, Sanctioned, sort of, if that makes sense. Okay. So we right. should we should maybe oh, okay. not judge. I think okay. he's still the man we thought he was. Is all I'm getting at. Oh, yeah. Good. Good to know. Thanks for the I don't really have update. much invested interest in Logan, to be honest, but it's that good to know. Yeah. Well, I just, you know, I, I don't want him, you know, robbing anybody, and I know that he's been a good friend to the market itself, and you know, with the books and things like that. So. I would have been devastated to hear he was hurting people, mm -hmm. uh, uh, you know. So. All right. more, more, should we circle around the fire instead? There's more people. I think that's probably <laughs> a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much for the update. Yeah. Uh, Ellie? Yes? Okay. Have you met Emerson yet? I have met Emerson. I was there when he okay. got his green. Oh, wonderful. He is wanting to do a project similar to yours, but more with maths and times. Uh, and I reckon I told him he should talk with you on that. Absolutely. Maybe y'all could buddy up on it. Yeah, um, the reason why I am going so incredibly uh, intense on the amount of paperwork oh, and the there. amount of, like, detailed records oh, sorry, for the yep. project that I'm doing, instead of just plotting it all down on a map, I'm writing down extensive this is where this like pen on the map comes from, and this is where this one comes from, because I'm hoping that it can encourage other people's projects in the future. All right. I, I want he's this got, to be a tool that can help yours. everyone. Hopefully, Rotten back safe and sound. Oh well, thank goodness, no. nobody had to endure my wailing. <laughs> yes. Hello. Yeah. Whoa. Hi. Hi. How are we doing? Hi. I'm doing good. How are you? Uh, sir, with the red vest. Oh, good so far. He Mr. is. Mr. Gave. Howdy. Howdy. <laughs> my, my name's Bruce. Gave uh, had the horse. A friend of Sam is here. Uh, they said oh, that wow. uh, you uh, were working on making your gun. That this uh, one less piece of my stick. Hideous. <laughs> hideous? On purpose? Is this cat food? Is this fucking cat food? That is I'm looking food. at. He brings it around <laughs> everywhere he goes, always. Absolutely. What it's day? Oh, yeah. it's, yeah. it's, it's gonna be a sad day when yeah, someone else inherits this cat food. No. Oh, okay, alright. Is it gold? This is, this is the fanciest fucking it's, gun it's I've seen. It's every, everything but gold, I think. <laughs> oh, okay. It's, I can't tell that the fire light I can tell. It was made to be the ugliest gun on the crossing, and it goes to uh, the latest ranger to get eaten by a Kruger or Panther, and I he's so carrying it around everywhere. No other <laughs> rain, other rangers just keep it on their horse because they do not want to be seen with it. Yeah, I'm this trying is to, pet food right here. I'm trying Let to do, me bring uh, my ugly gun. Trying to do something very similar <laughs> with my guns too because they keep getting stolen. The one I'm wearing right on, right now on my back is called the Bedwet and Thief. <laughs> wow. Good wow. Oh, wow. That's a great That's... name for a gun. Yeah, and then, uh, the... then I'm going to be getting a bolt action. I'm going to name that I Piss When I Fart. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Oh wow! I mean, yeah, I guess that is definitely a deterrent. No, <laughs> no, no criminals want that. Yeah, I hope not. No. Well, they might still steal it, but they probably won't announce what the gun's called. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but I don't think they want the embarrassment of that being taken by the law off of them, because that has some questions <laughs> that point. might not be good for their reputation. Yeah. <laughs> 
Imagine that conversation in the cells. Oh my god, that's gonna be gold. <laughs> Why do you have the bed wetting thief? Why the hell can, are you robbing banks with us? Go see a doctor. What the hell's wrong with you? Can, can we can, can we compare ugly guns? Oh no. Yeah, sure. Oh yeah. No, oh, no not this one. Thank you. Okay, Rooster, come come come. You also have ugly gun. Okay. Yep. <laughs> oh, I don't I don't gosh. think mine's ugly enough. Right. I think I really need to ugly it up better. Oh, yeah. oh. This cough's just getting worse. Uh, wait, 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 let me do this, uh, turn, turn, turn to your right. Oh, I thought we were gonna, we're gonna try to go back to back. Oh. <laughs> but there's three of us now, so it doesn't work. Hold on, hold on, it does work. Uh, you get to either side of me, and I just stand in the middle, and y'all can do the back There we go, thing. Oh, would you like me to take your picture? Yes, please. <laughs> okay, <laughs> one second, let me get my camera. A group picture of ugly guns. Yes, oh, this is perfect. Oh, look at this. This is a proper Western photo. Yeah. Oh, good, the sun's gonna come out. Montana Market Masterful Firearms. Sam, it for sure wins. I mean, it makes sense considering Sam is the only one who custom. Well, I mean, Sammy did customize that gun. Cat food has been around for a while. I, d I did customize my gun. I was trying oh. to make it ugly, and then it doesn't really... It, it doesn't look that bad. <laughs> I need it to really it to the two. It's just It's just in comparison. Yeah. I mean... Yeah. Uh, I mean, the bed button thief is a more apt name for the one in the middle. <laughs> yeah. Cat food's good though, and I like I like how what it's used for. You know, there's a tradition to it. That's good. He's the only person who carries it around with him everywhere though. Yeah, he, he wears it with pride. Every other ranger I've seen, they keep it on their horse because they do not want to bring it around. He is so proud of this gun. You cannot the, um, shame me with something like this. The is other that... rangers. Uh... And the rangers have come to an agreement that if I another ranger noticed. gets eaten by, uh, by a cat, right. the gun has to go to them. Mr. Atticus, you look quite injured. With Pat in it, so I am here. Uh, hey, uh, wait, wait, yeah. you want us to... Uh, uh, yeah. uh, Everything okay? Uh, well, what happened? I think, oh my gosh. I think actually you should uh, stand right here in front of me. I slipped and fell off a cliff and uh, oh my gosh. moved off broke of my that. arm and a couple of ribs. Uh, now, just want to do the. Uh, so sorry to hear that. No, I appreciate it. With my back to, uh, back to. I, uh, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's cute. Yeah. I, uh, what's Sammy's gun yeah. name? I have no. Clue. It's been a process. Uh, just hold your breath. To say the least. Yeah, I'm sure. You, I'm sure. Get this without it. Um, Is that why you were with that that group of medics, or or you just happened to be friends with them? Oh, I love that. Well, I happen to be friends with them, but Miss Kaziah Prim has been taking pretty express okay, care of me. One more where I'm on the okay, that's side. that's really good. Yeah, well, thank you for asking. It, it's very kind of you to notice. Yeah, I mean, I, I mean, you got that cast, and I, I, yeah, I'm sorry if I'm being, if I'm prying, I just... No, not at all. It's okay. Yeah. I'm, right. I'm pretty much an open book, you know. So. Okay. Um, here, I, I can hardly hear myself think. <laughs> yeah, it's hard when there's lots of people talking. Yeah. Do you have a library card, Eleanor? I do. I just got one okay. from Imogen. She didn't give me anything, though, but um, I'm oh, assuming... Oh, so like just now? Yeah, just now I, I asked for one, and, and she already got my telegram because I asked her to keep me updated on the Thomas Logan situation since I've got... Pretty heavy investment in the two books that I allowed him to publish. Sure. Um, do you mind if I get your telegram as well? We have a, a we have a log that I can. Sure. Yes, of course. Um, and for what it's worth, I'll, I'll tell you what I told her, since uh, it sounds like yeah. you're also in charge of the library. Uh, I, I would. Yeah, I work with Miss Imogen. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so this is what I told her. I told her basically, uh, you know, whatever happens with Thomas Logan, I really would like those books to be in circulation and print and um mm -hmm. if she can convince him to give her the copyright if you know you all still decide to start your own printing company you know unless now with the new information maybe that's not the case but uh basically we're gonna be talking about it yeah okay so um if he's willing to give up the copyright to you all i'm perfectly fine with that the idea was to give back to the market and so uh the thing 
the deal I had with Thomas would be the same for you both. You know, any mm -hmm. proceeds you make from those two books uh, that I allowed him to publish uh, would go straight back to the market. Absolutely, as it should. Yes. So, I, I really hope everything works out with, with him, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It'd be a shame well. to lose all those books that he publishes. Yeah, absolutely it would. I, I imagine in due time we'll figure out and get to the bottom of it. I also work for the Saints Daily News, and I, I know our team is looking into a lot of different things concerning a lot of uh, what's been circulating around, like, Valentine and such. I see. Okay. Well, best yeah. of luck to both of you. Oh, thank you. And uh, feel uh, free to use that telegram, that well, the one I will give you just now, <laughs> uh, yeah. to uh, update me on anything and going on. Of course. Uh, so that would be Eastern Sunset, 888. E S eight eight eight. Got it. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's Eleanor, E-L-E-A-N-O-R. And then my mm -hmm. last name is Clark, C-L-A-R-K. Perfect. Mm -hmm. And do you have any books that you, uh, do you have any books that you're interested in that we might keep an eye out for you? Uh, so far, uh, nothing on, so far, and I think that uh, Imogen was saying that you're out of stock right now. Excuse us, folks, for in the shootings. Yeah, things are looking a little slim. Yeah, <laughs> yeah so that's all right. Um, I also don't come to this market very often, but when I do, I, maybe next time I come, I'll see if there's a book that's ready for me. I would recommend. Sure. Well, I have my wagon now, and so that's going to be the mobile oh, wagon. So oh, during great. the week, I'll be able to. Oh, once perfect. we have books, yep. I'll be able Just to cart like them around. All right. That's so yeah. evil. We need to that see this. So yes. <gasps> That's so evil. This is going to be great. Yep. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh. <laughs> I'm, 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 I must... I must uh, I must have confused. You're supposed to stand when you shoot it. Sorry, I'm, I'm so that sorry. Takes, that's all right. That takes quite yeah. the punch. I felt, I felt yeah. the wind. Yeah. So just just reload it, and then you know oh, this know time how to stand, do that. stand up. So dramatic. I don't know how to do that. And oh. I think one was right. up. <laughs> I would absolutely love another shot at it. Okay, let me just hand this over to you. Another shot at it. It's good. See, when I first got the elephant rifle, I was like, I don't want to share this to anyone because I'm scared it'll be robbed. Now I'm just, everyone can shoot it if they want. <laughs> I can see anyone? why. <laughs> Careful, it really does it's like... It's as long as me. <laughs> <laughs> it really true. does pack a punch, so be, so be careful. <laughs> oh, mm, mm. You okay? Yeah, I just knocked the wind out of me a little bit. Are you okay? Nobody told her to catch that time. <laughs> oh, holy fuck. Oh, my it's God. Not the first time it's happened either. <laughs> Uh, I don't know what you expected. You've done this before. And she watched it happen. What's that? Well, her friend was saying uh, she'd done it before, and I said she also watched it happen to you. Yep. She did it anyway. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if I have a bruise on my ribs after that. <laughs> Oh, oh you're, you're gonna you're gonna feel it tomorrow. Okay. You're gonna feel it. Oh no! I feel it now. <laughs> <laughs> wait, you? Oh, wait. What? Oh, I actually got. Okay. Oh, she got knocked out. She just she just needs a moment. It's fine. But why the? Last time she was oh, even Ellie. crouched. This time she didn't crouch. She still got her ass kicked. Hey, Sir Dicky, oh, do you want to shoot it? Um, I'm worried about my hip. Oh, okay. Nice <laughs> <laughs> hey. move on your part. What if you stand up and I can like hold you? Um, <laughs> or rooster can hold you. Yeah, go on then. Go, go get it, Mr. Dicky. I just need another minute <laughs> here. Yeah, just need. Yeah. <laughs> She shot an elephant rifle and it just knocked the wind out of her. Oh boy. Oh no. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> yes. 
Yeah, yeah. She, you should have seen her ass over tea kettle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, that was awful. Just yeah, graphic. Yeah. All right, just one more minute, and then I'll help it, you stand it, up. Am I allowed to take a picture, or will you be you, upset? You might say that, that <laughs> elephant rifle okay, through her back. Okay, all right. <laughs> I, don't, Watch out, I feel like I don't need to say hold your breath, but hold your breath. <laughs> <laughs> right, could, you, could you stop bleeding so Love, much? Hello, hello. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <goodness laughs> gracious. Ellie, would you say that elephant rifle is pretty good at throwing it back? Shut up, Atticus. <laughs> 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 All right, I'm just going to snatch the gun from you. Okay, let me let me know when uh, when Hopefully when I'm allowed to put her back in. Uh, okay. You're there. Yeah. There she is. Sammy said that you said Wow. Say say again. Anybody else want to try? Brave. Yeah. I've tried before. Sammy did the same thing to me. Brave the elephant. <laughs> Jeepers. Uh, this may seem mildly out of place or out of left field, but I just want to say how much I enjoy these Saturdays with y'all at the market. Oh, this is fun, you. and this has been fun for a long time, so thank you. Right. Well, thank I you. will make sure you don't fall over, so stand upright. <laughs> right. What? You what? fired a rifle before, right? Crouch. Oh, yeah. I've never Crouch. seen one of these. Oh, would, you, would you like me to stand in? I could brace him. Yeah, you, you, you hold me, Rooster. Hold yeah, yeah, I got you. You hold so nice, 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 nice sentiment. Oh, Rooster. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. Oh my God. God. <laughs> oh, is he? Remember oh, to hold on to no him. failure. Hold oh on. no. Oh. Sorry, I lost my. Rooster, you're supposed to hold him. <laughs> Oh, Rooster, what happened? Rooster, what? No, what? don't say that. Oh, you said Rooster, you wouldn't fake your death. Your <laughs> you cannot fake Rooster. your death for advertisement. Rooster, you had one job. I tried. Oh, no. Atticus, here's a story for you. <laughs> yeah, I got it. I, I got it. <laughs> oh, wow. I just, I just realized that that is exactly what would be in the paper. Attic Atticus Montana market murder. That's, that <gasps> is Sir quite Dickie a murder oh, no. by rifle. <laughs> Momo market mishap. Oh, it's a little bit too. Tell me I did not kill another gentleman. What's that? Oh, don't. Oh, my God. 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 Bravo, bravo. <laughs> I can't believe you put you you got my elephant rifle into an advertisement. Oh, come on. <laughs> I, <the> opportunity. <laughs> that is a cute. That is a cute little article. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Dicky yeah. White, using his ability to uh, be acting and and doing an advertisement for his new. Uh, his new yeah, play. Yeah. Uh, I was also mm. acting totally. Uh, yes, yeah, so was I. <laughs> really, absolutely. truly. Absolutely. Uh, Sir Dicky amazing, White, amazing. when is your next play? Um, mid May. Mid May. We don't know. We haven't got a date. We yet. look forward to it. Lovely. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Maybe we'll come and do a small scene at the, at the market. <gasps> oh, oh, that, well, that would be wonderful. Tickets. There's a, a stage and everything. Oh, yes, and costume and everything. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh. Please do. It would be lovely. Yeah. Yeah. Imagine, have you ever been to yes, Mr. Dickie White's I'm, I'm uh, buying, drama I'm, I'm club? I have not. For, for it's us. the most fun. Oh, for, for, for that. I might oh. have to do that at some point. Yeah, I think you'd really like it. Drama club. Yeah, drama club, yeah. What do you do at a drama club? All right, I'm going back to the You fight. learn how to act and you improvise you and it's very comedic. Drama club? Let's show yeah, tell you. them. Would you like a love advertisement? Uh, we would love one. Would you like to use the stage? Yeah, sure. Yes! Ooh. Ooh. Um, does anyone who comes to Drama Club want to come up and show? Ellie? Yeah, yes. come up? <laughs> Julia? I'm all right, thanks. Okay. You want to sit down? I think I'm missing Rich. <laughs> Uh, 
I can't feel my torso. Yeah, me either. <laughs> I, I feel like I, I feel like I sh should rub some paste or something on my rib cage. It's still reverberating. Is this heaven? <laughs> it might be. <laughs> Wait, did anyone see so lucky? Oh. Mm. Oh. That's what did me in. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh god. He's just got a headache. We'll be a few moments. All right. He's preparing his monologue. <laughs> In the meantime... When you sit down, I'll do it. Okay. Well, in the meantime, uh, what, yeah. we, what we do sometimes is um, we have sort of... It's called improv. And you go up and you just do things sort of impromptu and it's acting and so sometimes we have this uh, monoluge game and so <laughs> people come up and we shout out into the crowd you know to give a scenario and then three people will go up on stage and you say when to freeze and then you can find out what the characters are thinking behind oh, wow. the scenes almost and it's really fun I don't, think, I don't oh. think I could ever improvise a scene. That seems like too much pressure. Yeah, I know it's really hard to do improvisation and acting and pretending that you're a character that you're not, but it's actually pretty okay. I think you could do it. I don't know about that. I, c I could never do it. Who says so? Never. Seems difficult. Yeah. It's kind of we would love to see it in action, though. If you Yeah. We'll just see what Sadiki is, and then we can, can go ahead with it. I think he got a headache. Is anyone else here from theater group? Uh, Attic is. Yeah. I'm an admirer of the theater group now. J Juliet, you want to come up? There's Mr. Dickey. I guess. Oh, yeah. Hello. Hello. What are we doing? Uh, what do you need? Do one your, scene your from the monologue game? Just mm -hmm. to show them? Yeah. Hello. Most of us feel like we can never... Oh, okay. What did you call it? Uh, I actually need to go. So we gotta say oh, goodbye to Rooster. Yeah, that's right. Howdy. Um, did, uh, did we get, a we get themed? No, I actually checked all the boxes. Uh, the only box that They're seems like it might have. I'm sorry? Are they on groups of five? The only one that doesn't is the potatoes. There's four in there. Oh. But other than that, everything else is fine. Okay, well, hopefully no one snagged a potato. How dare they, those <laughs> sons of bitches. <laughs> All right, unfortunately, I, I actually have to lay my head. But uh, oh, they're okay. doing an improv scene over there. If you want to see what they're doing, they're trying to uh, advertise the drama club. I was ordered to watch the, f the food in the, oh, the wagon. Okay. Yeah, right. I'm not allowed to have any fun. Oh, <laughs> I <Hi, Clay. laughs> I actually have to lay my head, but it was good to see you. Oh. Oh, fine. Okay. Good night, Chimo. <laughs> okay, good night. <laughs> see you later. Yeah. Bye. Yeah, it was good to see you, Chimo. Good to see you, too. Yeah. Wait, so you uh, you waiting over here, too? No, I'm... I'm... Yep, 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 right, I'll go over here where I left Bruno. looking right nobody's looking nobody's looking okay bye all right let me go raid somebody oh hey baby go watch the go watch the improv all 
All right. Um, might be on tomorrow. Not sure. Okay, bye. Thanks for hanging out. <laughs>